Okay, on today's episode of Convenient Quest, we're checking out these. These are sardine potato chips. In fact, right here in Japanese, it says, Watashi no oil sardine. So, oil sardine potato chips. And right here, it recommends to eat them with a highball. So, let's crack them open and see if they're any good. What do you think? I'm already very skeptical, but let's try them. Okay, yeah, they smell very fishy. So uh, they just look like regular, you know, innocent potato chips in there, but they, they are emitting a strong fishy smell. So let's give them a try. Hmm. It's very weird. They're slightly fishy, but they kind of have like a floral flavor to them. Wow. Surprise, surprise, the oil sardine potato chips are not bad. Hmm. I wonder what my breath's going to smell like later, though. I wouldn't say they're my favorite potato chips, but considering that the bar was really low for these, they're actually not bad at all. But I got a couple drinks while I was in there as well. There's this Metz... Uh, pink ginger ale, which I thought was kind of interesting. And I also got this Coca-Cola Zero Sugar. Yeah, I, that's pretty uh, pretty normal, isn't it? There's nothing too special about that, but I'm not sure if you guys have this in your countries, but for the holiday season, they've come out with this uh, unique way to open your, your Coke, or at least to uh, present it as a gift. So you're meant to peel back Let's see if I can do this. You're meant to peel back this label, which is stuck on quite good here. Uh, come on. There you go. And then underneath there's like a pull tab that you are meant to grab. There we go. And then you pull, and as you can see, the label is kind of bunching up there. And I think you're meant to wrap it around. Let's see if I can do this right. And seal it again on this side. Not sure if I'm doing that right. But it's supposed to form into the shape of a beautiful bow. As you can see, I'm not quite very skilled at that. But I guess there you go. You can wrap it up like that and uh, put it under your tree and enjoy Christmas. I'm not going to drink this one though. Um, it's too pretty, right? So yeah, next time I'm going to review the uh, the pink ginger ale. So in English it says pink ginger ale here, but down in Japanese here it says peach, peach ginger ale. So we're going to give that a try. Um, I know over on my friend uh, What Chef's channel, he just reviewed a Coke product that was called Ginger Coke. It had a, a ginger flavor. So uh, if, you, if you're interested in checking that out, I'll put a link. You can go check that out over on his channel. But Today, we're gonna drink this peach and ginger ale. So, let's see how this is. If you're not familiar with Metz, it's a, it's a uh, Japanese company that makes, it usually makes colas and things like that, but um, recently they've been making all sorts of different kinds of drinks. And last year they came out with a Star Wars themed drink that I reviewed. Um, there was the light side and the dark side, all the hype leading up to the new movie. Um, so far this year, I haven't seen, I haven't really seen anything from any company regarding uh, the, the movie that's coming out just, I guess, in about three weeks' time. Um, but hey, we'll keep our eyes out for that. So uh, let's give this a try. Huh. It's very fruity. It certainly has, the dominant flavor is the peach. The ginger part, if you, if you didn't tell me there was ginger in there, I may not even think that there, were, there was ginger in there. I think it's good. I mean, it's not something I would normally drink, a peach uh, soda, but it doesn't taste bad. It's uh, refreshing. Um, I'd probably be done after I finish this one, and I don't think I'd ever buy it again, but as for the ginger part, you know, if it had, if they'd put more ginger in it, it would have been a lot more potent. 
but as it is I don't really notice that there's actually ginger in there at all it's just a peach a peach drink um, but still it's alright okay so there you have it Watashi no oil sardine the oil and sardine potato chips which sound pretty disgusting but actually were not bad at all I was very surprised by those and the Mets pink uh, ginger ale which uh, is peach and ginger ale it, you know it's not bad it's just mainly peach though so I guess I'm gonna finish these off um, thanks for watching and tune in next time <laughs>